It's not every time that I'm hosting Tog. I just, whoops, interrupted my hosting of him. Every time. It seems that every time I'm hosting Tear of Grace, I just, whoops, interrupt him for the sake of doing something meanderingly more pointless and more stupid than whatever he's doing. Also, I like that I titled the stream on Twitch, I'm Drunk Frame Part Infinity Stoned. <laughs> and I am drunk. <laughs> I just don't know how drunk. <laughs> you know, being drunk helps with the illusion that, um... I enjoy existing anymore because missing several fucking teeth in my mouth and not being able to eat food is a huge problem. And it's a far cry from um, something that's feasible or even doable at this point to get implants or, or replacements because they can't afford it. That's why I've chosen to inebriate. That's the word I made up a, a while but uh, a while back ago. I was about to say bow as in combining back and a go together. Oh yeah, I'm I'm sufficiently inebriated. <sighs> oh, hiccups. Hiccups is a sign that I'm incredulously inebriated. I was just in my orbiter before I started stream recording. Why did he kick me out to the home screen? Oh, it usually doesn't do that. It usually lets me pick up right where I left off in Warfragma. I, I was was standing somewhere. No, literally, right here, at this console, is where I was standing. And I was looking at... Steve, Scott, and DE, you're fucking idiots. The game loads slower after the updates you put out that you claim to make it load faster with. Fucking morons. Yeah, I came over here, sorted these by name... And I went to look at <clears throat> Loki Prime Relics. And it only shows the ones I have. When six updates ago, it showed the ones that I had already went through. As well as the ones that I have. Even back here. In in the relic thingy. Yeah, hang on. Let me type this out. Low. Key. Prime. Yeah, there I go. You see, now it only shows the ones I have. Instead of the ones that I've already opened, which it used to show. It used to... It used to go through, you know, you go through, the, and then there, it... It's, this says it's a preview of the Lith G1. This is because the relic is not vaulted. And I've already acquired and used all of my Lith G1s. 
But for the ones that are vaulted... It apparently doesn't show me anymore. Which is why I can't look at Loki Prime. Um, which part am I missing? I've got it over here in the foundry. I've got all but one part. G H N J K L Loki. Yeah, the systems. The Loki Prime systems. I had a, a few relics for the Loki Prime systems, but I used them all, and they didn't drop a, a systems. But, you know, Luck Strike for the RNG bullshit that goes on gave me a fucking Neuroptics without using all of the Neuroptics relics. And with that nonsense of complaining and whining about the quality of life improvements that need to be re-implemented, Blee, yes, I know I said Blee, I'm on to other things. I'm fully cognizant, self-aware, conscious, and sentient of my own actions while incredibly inebriated. Which is word I made up just to fuck with everyone's normalcy bias. Inebriated and lubricated, all in the same word. Inebriated. I like the way it sounds. Now what I'm gonna do is subsume another frame sacrifice to the wall of flesh, otherwise known as Gary. Otherwise known as a Warframe video. Which is a horrible introductory seven minutes into the fucking video as is. I think I'll do Hydroid. I could have just came over to In Progress and claimed a bunch of other things that I wanted and needed to claim. Uh. Instead of paying me to do dumb shit in games so that I can grab more weapon slots in Warframe, which I will eventually do as well, <coughs> I'm going to go ahead and say, give me fallacy credits of your own volition so that I can get drunk and do more dumb shit. in video games. Yes, I will get inebriated. Yeah, I'll let the Freudian slip. Like the nipples of your Mama. And that was delayed on purpose. What else was I talking about? How many frames can I claim? Apparently, I can claim them all. How many? All of them. Also, I've farmed all of the bosses that drop parts for frames. Now, I just need to do... Um... Quests. Like the Limbo Theorem, or the New Strange for Chroma, or the Sands of Anaros, or go and farm um, Disruptions for Gauss. Oh, wait. That's a lie. I have not farmed all of the bosses. Technically, the Exploiter and the profit taker or mama is a boss through which i can farm parts for hildren to that's what i remember right now technically those are bosses i can farm i 
think it's the exploiter orb. The ones that stereotype the one that is stereotypically British. You know, if I had the budget for editing and, and the software for editing, I would put in a clip of it saying medicine children. Mother needs her medicine. Just like um what's his what's his Macari face did. Yeah, Macari. Macari Morph. I've got the glyph. I should know. I said I was going to do Hydroid. I'm going to do Hydroid. I'm going to put the Tentacle God into the Tentacle Wall of Flesh and make the ultimate Japanese Entai. While a train goes through in the background. And I'm probably going to get 78.9% to the way of the 10th Metamorphosis. It's difficult to say with only run front tooth. Run. I mean one. Subsume. Oxides, calts, and synthetics for him. It's time to feed Gary. Oxides. Um, two thousand, two million, one million, five million. And calps. I need to fetch more iridite. Uh. Yeah, I know that the wall of flesh doesn't actually burp, so... My legitimate burp that was unplanned. Just imagine that that was planned for the wall of flesh to be burping with. Otherwise known as Gary. I named it mine, him, it, she, he, it, shit, it, Gary. Its name is Gary. I have no idea what gender it is. Get off my fucking tits. Fucking feminazis. Fuck off. Cubic diodes. Or ass to write. Ass to write with. Or cubic diodes. 12,000 or 5,000. I'll go with the lesser of the two weevils. What was the other one I needed? It was oxides, calcs. I think it was synthetics. I could be horribly mistaken. Which is why I'm going to back out of this, feed him the, the garbage. Yes, it was synthetics. I would rather be right by which of not actually doing it and guessing it was correct and go back in and redo it than to be wrong and feed him the wrong thing and waste resources just to figure out, oh fuck, I was wrong. To go back in and feed him the correct resource all over again. Eh, I can do that. Yep, I can do that. And I could definitely have done some of that. Yep, you can you can eat those, Gary. Have fun. Subsumate. Hydroid. The the tentacle the 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 tentacle of loot. Not of loot, but it's better than saying the hentai tentacle. You know what? Fuck it. Hydroid, the hentai tentacle. I'm sacrificing hydroid, the hentai tentacle. To the wall of tentacly flesh, otherwise known as Gary. And now that joke has grown stale. It's grown stale. It's, it's very groaned. Like the groaner from Super Mansion. If you haven't watched Super Mansion, then by all means. Please do so, and then rewatch this stream recorded video 
so that you'll understand the the joke so that you can laugh harder damn you laugh harder I'm so drunk niggers prime necros niggers whatever black lives don't fucking matter that's why I'm a nigger just to fuck with your normalcy bias because you instinctively associate nigger with the derogative slang terminology for a black person but that's wrong a nigger is by literal Merriam-Webster's International Dictionary's definition an ignorant person so I'm just fucking with your normalcy bias. I'm just fucking with you, the viewer. For shits and gigs. It's a psycho fuck. It's all in my head. I think, therefore, I achieve victory. And yes, that's to fuck with everyone's normalcy bias. The old uh, Greek Roman statue of the thinker and the axiom that has been derived therefrom. Cogito ergo sum. I think, therefore, I am. Yo, daddy. I can't help it. I just love fucking with everyone's normalcy bias. It's just a part of who I am now. It's just a matter of the sarcastically satirical parody that is my existence. And if you don't like it... Well, then leave a dislike and fuck off and don't come back. <laughs> if you want more of it, then, you know... Come back later. I don't feel comfortable telling people to leave a like, a comment, and fucking actually go on to the links in the description to do fucking nonsensical um, support of... Hmm. I think I'll do this arbitration. I, I'm really not personally comfortable with telling everyone in every video that I do forever to go into the, the description and see the links for PayPal, Patreon, or, and whatever else is there to go and throw fallacy credits, aka money, my way so that I can maintain being drunk 24-7 <laughs> and do even more dumb shit in games possibly even a game you want me to see do dumb shit in as long as it's not player versus player because I fucking hate it and the only reason that I played with Satan aka Joe in that fucking player versus player bullshit is because he wouldn't shut the fuck up and he told me the game had a multiplayer co-op option it did. They didn't keep it fucking properly updated. They just let it turn to shit. And it wound up just me and him doing player versus player shit, which pissed me off. And then, you know, I've got in one of the recordings where I went fucking 20 deaths. Not 20 deaths. I went 20 murders of the enemies. That, that could count as a death. And then one death of my own. And then one extra death of the uh, opposing team enemies. At which point I decided, you know what? Fuck it. I might as well retire while I'm on top. Fuck this shit. There. If there are any Grenier left in this hallway, they're very unhappy. Also, I saw a video by Gaz TTV. Yeah, I know it's Twitch TV, but you named your YouTube channel that. That's fucking retarded as far as I'm concerned. So, Gaz, I saw a video by him talking about the, uh anti-camping countermeasures which is redundant 
I know what I said, anti-camping countermeasures, that's redundant. <laughs> that DE implemented. <clears throat> because they've reduced the fucking loot drop so significantly and horridly that people have to fake fucking make macro keyboard commands to fucking AFK farm this game because it's such a fucking chore and they're tired of be being a realistic chore when they've got realistic chores and they don't have the time to spend in this fucking game. There, did I say it accurately enough? Hi as drunk as I am, can coherently understand why people making AFK macro commands for this game is something that they want to do and are doing because the game is so fucking grind heavy. Gaming. All of gaming. Not just Warframe is a service and a product to everyone's right and pursuit of happiness. I don't give a fuck that the the uh, unalienable right to the pursuit of happiness is only written in black and white ink on the fucking goddamn Declaration of Independence by Americans. It's endemic to all of existence. Every living being has the right to pursue their own happiness. It doesn't matter what fucking country you're from. And DE, if you can't fucking respect that, you're just a little bitch. Make the game less grindy. I've already made suggestions for that. Make it to where the loot drop increases with every master rank. I have suggested that in the fucking three-page dissertation I sent to you. make it to where the player has their power fantasy, acquires it, molests it, goes out to date and fondles it. We get more to use as we mastery rank up, thereby making mastery rank mean something more than just look at how many toys I've played with, thereby providing a goal for newer players to stick with the game and accomplish thereby driving the potential to increase sales revenue for both you and Microsoft and Tencent. Fuck you if you disagree. Greedy fucking Jewish acting bitches. When I act like a bitch, I'll treat you like a bitch. I'll just fucking tell Satan fuck it all. Right fucking here, right fucking now. I don't give a fuck what you think. I'm right, you're wrong. Get the fuck over yourself, you self-righteous piece of shit. Now, continuing on to the idiocracy. Hey! You grenier bastard, how dare you knock me down? You are ready. Go Ooh, to I got a sculpture. If I were with a team of uh, people who I knew what the fuck were they were doing and you know we all knew each other's strengths and weaknesses and what we were skilled with and, and yada 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 you know exposition of the um, technical variety halfway to infinity and back then you know me and a team we would go and camp in a fucking corner and just let the grenier run into us and destroy them but me being by myself, yeah, I'm just running around like a fucking chicken with its head cut off. Like, every single arbitration drone needs to drop one or two Vitus Essence at minimum, at base of mine. And then that needs to increase when you hit Master Rank 15, 20, 25, and 30. 
So that you're getting a, to a total minimum of five Vivisessions at Mastery Rank 30 for each fucking Arbitration Drone. Because people don't have fucking time to sit here for 48 fucking hours on end doing nothing but farming and grinding your goddamn game. And I say you're ironically, because it, it doesn't belong to you, DE. You want to know who it really belongs to? Same person that all of existence belongs to. Me. Leave whatever the fuck you want. I fuck with your normal biases. I'm testing all of you. Even in this horrible time, Known as the, oh, what is it that uh, your fucking religion says? The end of days. And yeah, even in the end of days, I'm still testing you fucking plebeian bitches to see which one of you is actually worth giving a shit about. So far, all of you bureaucrats, politicians, governors, etc., etc., you're not worth a shit. All of you corporate level motherfuckers are going to a hell worse than anything you can ever imagine. And even if you start obeying me now, doing what the fuck I tell you to do, it's not gonna change a goddamn thing. I'm still going to send you into hell. A worse hell than you're already in. I'm sick of your shit. Sick of your corruption. Fuck you, I don't care. You didn't care long enough, so now, fuck it. I'm returning it right back. Fuck all of you. Why am I even bothering talking about it at this point? I know none of you fucks are listening. None of you fucks give a shit. I might as well get some focus. This knockback stuff. As we mastery rank up, we should become more and more immune to it. It's just fucking annoying. I gotta knock stone. Listen, you arbitration drone! Stop putting an extra shield of immunity on top of the jackasses that I fucking turned to stone. Okay? The Tenno operative just found three fucking good assassins. That should be a minimum of 15. People don't have time to spend on this. I mean, I have infinite fucking time to spend on this, but I'm not going to! while I'm still ahead. Or at least do a hasty fallback and retreat. Yeah, I saw my health go down to like two or three.
Every time a YouTuber points to a thing and says, Look at how efficient this is for getting the game completed in the limited amount of time you have available as a commonplace person. DE comes in and says, Oh yeah, we have to nerf that because we want you to spend every fucking goddamn waking hour playing our game as our slave. Yeah, the, you're the enemy of fun. You want a negative slant on videos? Fine, I'll give it to you. Because you lied about... Because you perceive a negative slant where there is none with everyone else's videos, so fine. Here the fuck it is. You're a worthless, fucking, meanderingly pointless bitch who's gobbling up everyone's time, attention, effort, and energy just because you imagine a slight against you. You're a fucking bitch. No one likes that shit. No one appreciates being treated like a slave, D.E. Go fucking kill yourselves. Every last goddamn one of you. Because you can easily be replaced with people who care. Just like Vitable, who doesn't give a fuck about its fellow living being. Who thinks that... It's all about how much punishment and torture you can take and keep going. Yeah, fuck all of you for that shit. Holy fuck. Everything's been so fucked up. Even getting drunk can't produce the illusion that I enjoy existing anymore. This is totally fucked. I need something stronger than getting drunk. Or maybe everyone else needs to stop being a bitch and actually give a fuck about their fellow living being. Ain't that right, Fittable? Oh, I'm sorry, I forgot. I banned you from being able to comment on the YouTube video. Little piece of shit. Take that and deal with it, bitch. Here's another thing. I never said or even entertained the delusionary thought that I'm better than all of existence that I created until I dealt with you fucking humans. They're the most corrupt pieces of shit in all of existence that have ever existed. And I've created billions upon billions uncountable numbers. Literally uncountable by even my own standards. Little jewels of existence to add as decoration and a mark of my own accomplishment and skill as a primal being. Unfucking countable billions of beings. Beyond billions. And you humans are the absolute most corrupt that have ever and will ever exist. You are running out of what do you think that Consider means? Extraction. When the being that you created you says you're the most corrupt. As long as you can. Don't call me God, I don't like it. Not it. My name's Katana. And I'm the blade that's gonna cut out for how corrupt you are. Oh, shit. Now I gotta leave. The sculpture, which is probably gonna be worth 2,000 endo at most, and another 1,200 endo. But mostly, I want to see more Vitus Essence drop.
because there's other other video games that I want to play. And if your argument is it's a free to play game, please go fucking kill yourself. I don't care to hear that argument anymore. I've already put well over 500 fucking dollars into this game. I've earned and purchased the right to have whatever the fuck I want. If you don't like it, go kill yourself because I don't fucking care. I stopped caring quite some time ago. Yeah, I remember what I wanted to do. I wanted to go and look up which relic was to get the uh, part of Loki and then go into a fucking um, void fissure that would actually include that particular type of relic and hope that randomly in a public session someone would be using that along with whatever else was going on. That's what I originally intended. But because they switch update to update from telling you which relics you've already opened that are vaulted after you've used them all up, it just, it's a f total fucking piss take. It's a fucking nuisance. After I've opened a relic, whether I have it on hand as, as a few extra or not, I should be told on both the fucking relic console and the fucking ooh, codex which goddamn relic it is because I've already fucking used it so that I can go and jump into the appropriate fucking uh, void fisher without typing it into Google and Googling it because it's supposed to be in the fucking game itself. Just another reason to say fuck you, DE. You're being a bitch. And on top of all of that, the very first YouTuber I encountered introducing me into this game before I decided to ignore what he said and test it for myself was RevXDev. For all of you who give a fuck about that sort of thing. That was before DE banned him from playing the game. In my initial assessment from looking at what he said and looking into his emotional state and everything was that DE didn't deserve to have the game. I chose to disregard my initial assessment based on the emotional state that they had pushed him into, which is considered terrorism here in the United States. Yeah, they terrorized a player. Don't worry, everyone. You'll eventually realize that I'm saying the truth after it's too fucking late, like usual. After I chose to ignore everything that I would observed on him and investigate the game for myself, I've come to the exact same collusion on... Collusion... I have concluded the exact same thing all over again. Again, DE doesn't deserve to guide the development and growth of this game. They don't know how to uphold everyone's right and privilege to the pursuit of happiness. They don't deserve to exist because they refuse to do what's right.
and they do what they think they want. I'm sick of everyone being a self-righteous bitch. Okay, Microsoft, you're going to give me multiple pings letting me know that things are happening that I already know what's happening. Thank you very much for that. Yeah, she used to be a bitch, but she's mellowed out in these past few years. So, y you might just want to call me a son of a former bitch now. <laughs> okay, son of a former bitch. That's too long, you son of a bitch. <laughs> Look, you, I will not have you inadequately representing myself in my own streamcast. I do what the hell I want whenever I want. You already know that shit. I don't care if you're screen streamcast. Listen, or you! The hell you're hey! Fucking doing. I'm talking! Shut up so I can out talk you! <laughs> Listen, you, I'm incredibly <laughs> drunk right now at the moment. I found some vodka somewhere. Ooh. Oh. Guess who got it for me? The person you refer to as bitch. Who I refer to as formerly has been in the past a bitch, but now has finally learned the basics of being a parent. A.K.A. Mom. Oh, I thought it was Dad. No, he's still a piece of shit. Both of them, the stepdad and the biological progenitor or contributor of sperm to my existence in the physical variety format. Which is the only real title that piece of fucking shit is worth! Don't worry. The biological progenitor of my physical being contributed far less to my social, psychological, economical, and geopolitical development. I had to learn things my own damn way. It was a fucking bitch toilet training myself. I want that. Shit's always For years, crazy. I thought that snakes lived in the toilet and ate my own shit. <laughs> For years, I believed that when I was between the ages of two and six. I believed in um in the bathtub. There's sharks that lived in the drain. You wow! It's a small world. We both thought that crazy shit lived down the drain. Besides the shit that we, you know, excreted into the drain. Yeah, I was always afraid of taking showers. <laughs> Why were you afraid of taking a shower because when a shark would l prefer a body of water to you know, swim around in, which would be the tub filled with water as opposed to a shower? I'm not for sure. I was a little fucking kid. I just got done watching fucking Jaw. <laughs> you got. You were a child that had just finished watching the movie Jaws, and you were afraid to take a shower because a shark might swim through the the nothing of the water that wasn't there at the time. Yes. <laughs> at the and I'm drunk right now, and I can coherently stream more logic and sense into the world than you can as a child. Oh, I wasn't fucking sure how fucking. Stuff did that. Well, I watched fucking horror movies back, back when I was young. That, that uh, shit was fucking crazier than fucking now. Uh. No. You perceived it to be crazier because you are young and inexperienced at life. <laughs> eh. I still kind of don't like As true as that moms. may be. <laughs> You better not watch Killer Clowns from Outer Space. I've, um, I've seen the original it, then I've seen... Oh dear God. I mean, oh dear me. Oh dear Satan and hell that does not exist right then now because we're already in it. I watched the new one, and I could 
I could bear the new one, but I don't think I'll ever go back to the old one. Why won't you go back to watching the old version of It by Stephen King? Because, um... <laughs> that's what made me kind of scared of clowns. You know what's really fucked up? Have, have you, before we continue this conversation, have you actually watched the movie Killer Clowns from Outer Space? Um, yeah, I think so. I'm not for sure, actually. Okay, they, they encapsulated people in uh, big giant globs of cotton candy, stuck a crazy straw in them, and then drank their blood. That's fucking crazy. Okay. There's a YouTuber. I forgot his Brandon Tennold. Cult Classic Reviews. He actually did a cult classic review of Killer Clowns from Outer Space. You can watch that. It's a summary of the whole fucking film. Actually, you could watch the whole fucking film on YouTube. YouTube has its own fucking um, film thingy that you can watch free with ads. Or you could just purchase it and watch it without ads. So anyway, killer clowns from outer space. They're actually a real species of living beings that exist. And the only reason that they look like clowns is because they develop that way through magical influence. I don't want to fucking doubt it. I mean, how else do you think we dragons have fun? How else do you think Satan and I entertained ourselves in the long lull between the emergence of one existence and of species that's worth interacting with to the next? Don't ask me. Hell, I don't fucking know. I'm asking you to theoretically ponder the scenarios. Or as Q put it to Picard, the probabilities of life! Eh, I'm too stoned to think about that kind of stuff. That's an excuse. You're leaning on being stoned like a crush. Exactly. I'm drunk and I'm more coherent than you can be when you're sober. Yeah, I don't fucking doubt it. <laughs> yeah, I just suppress my incredulous, incredulous, and that is a word, Look it up. I just suppress my incredulous intellect most of the time around you because, well, I enjoy the simpler things in life and so do you. Uh, that's what makes me go through life. <laughs> Keeping it simple. That's what makes life worth living. Exactly. Keep it simple and enjoy the moment. K-I-S-S. -S. Which I discovered a long time ago before I, the YouTuber AVE says it, but I like the way AVE says it. Keep it simple, stupid. Speaking of which, I have to facilitate the use of the lavatorial restroom. Oh, nice. In other words, I have to take a piss. I'll be back. Uh, I'll be here to entertain. Maybe. I don't know. Is it this way? Yeah. Guess in this yeah, this is the elevator. <laughs> I'm guessing this is the reactor room. Let's make this Okay, I, I know I'm in... I want to say Terraria, but that's that's just my brain talking to me right now, because it's drunk. <laughs> I know I'm in Warframe right now. 
Do you give a fuck to join me, or do you want to finish what we started in, in the uh, Halo oh, thing? No. Oh, I'm in Warframe right now. Hmm. I can build a reactor, but that takes four mine. I don't want four mine, too. Is that right? I already started a reactor on your dojo. Yeah, but I was gonna, I was gonna create another one. Cause things, Ooh. things say three reactors will do everything or something like that. No, I said to you regarding reactors is to go one floor down through an elevator and then make an entire. A floor of nothing but reactors. But you made and... the top, top, top on. No, 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 no. That one's temporary, so that we can make the elevator and then make the T junctions and the other connecting things to make more reactor rooms oh. on the lower floor. Oh. Okay. I know. I fucked up and made an elevator, and I didn't. Uh... <sighs> okay, listen. Before we continue, De. You need to have your shit fixed on the fucking make a dojo thing where you make rooms. Um, it's hell? totally fucking bored. Why the hell is you need to stop. going up? I know, that's what I fucked up on. It's supposed to go down so that you can make more reactors on a sub-level. And that's what I'm talking about. I, I pressed the rotation button, but it didn't show me which fucking rotation it was in. What the fuck? He needs to fix a lot of quality of life improvements that need to be done in this game. Um, there, there are literally dozens multiplied by dozens. There, there's at least 300 different quality of life improvements that need to be made to this game. How do you take it off? You have to destroy the room. Yeah. By which you have to wait until it's completed, it and you completed. have to destroy it. So I can go up and down on it. Okay. So, um... There should be a little console inside the elevator oh. room okay, that lets it. you destroy it. Okay. And, and you need to make that elevator go down, and... Does it give you the forma and everything back for destroying it? So that you can rebuild it? Um, no, it don't look like it. it looks like it just... Okay, that's another quality of life. That would be number 301 of quality of life improvements that need to be made to um, the game, D.E. Oh, cunts. it takes two hours to destroy it. So, God. I'm not sure, so I guess... Like, how would I know that that it gave the stuff. You know what, dude? Don't worry about it. We can always sue the entire gaming industry for uh, high treason later in life. Because, no, no, you know, like in the, they, like, they're taking the up our time had, um, without providing the entertainment value that we seek. That is their fucking responsibility to uphold our pursuit of happiness as gaming is nothing but the pursuit of happiness and the pursuit of happiness as defined by the United States Declaration of Independence is the goddamn unalienable right to all life yes I'm changing the wording it says all men but I'm saying all life in existence so that it covers everything equally and equitably as it should I thought they had, like, a resource thing that you could give to the clan. There is. You just have to build it first. Oh. Yes, I should build I it off one of the rooms. I think it's the... It's not the trading post. It's the... I don't remember what the fuck it's called. It looks like the... It's the same in-game model, physically, as the trading post, but it's called something else. It's like clan resources or something. You know what? They don't have a trading post. 
or it's called something else or something. Hang on, I'm gonna go in and look for it myself. Clan trading post, fucking whatever. Uh, is Decorations. Mm, no. It's gonna be... Where's the little console? There it is. Decorations. Banners. Lots of Bruce banners here. Catwalks. Window and pillars. Energy turbines. Fuck me, there's a lot of bullshit in here. Hold on. Natural. Atmospheric, sentient, Solaris United, all. They got a Koopa Leech um, trading place. It's not under decorations. I guess I should make a oracle. I guess I'll put, um, put the oracle right here. Son of a bitch, we should be able to place it, like, in this room. Apparently, I can't place it. Oh, I must. Either that or I'm not looking under the correct thing. I must have to place it because. <laughs> Treasury. Vaulted decorations. Nope. Is it in the start menu? Fine. Yeah, go to go in the start menu. Go to decorations and go to regular decorate and see what you can place. This shit is not explained by any means at all. Um, to be honest, if oh, it were under decorations, yeah, it should be under Tenno. This, uh, Tenno. The Ascension Altar is a thing you can use. It it allows you to get um. Place well, every a, time a place I've used it, you get alliance for on the, every ascension. Or <clears throat> tree drum. Ten L AI system interface. Does it give you a description of what that is? The interface? Yeah. A small computer system to interface interface with 10 AI. That doesn't tell either of us jack fucking shit about that particular item. Uh, pretty much. <laughs> is that under the Tenno tab? Yeah. Yeah, no, seriously, it doesn't tell us jack shit about what it is. It doesn't tell us if it's functional or if it's just decorative. 
That's a severe fucking problem. Hey, you're telling me. Yeah, because under decorations, decorate. Under the tab of Tenno, the Ascension Altar, a place to pledge allegiance to the clan so that it may ascend to the next clan rank. It doesn't tell you that interacting with it upon an Ascension Ritual gives you any reward, which it should, and it actually does give you a reward. In my experience, uh, for the clan I've been through, it's just, uh, endo. Should I put a trading post up in here? Oh, treasury. Treasury. Yeah, where, what tab so, is that under? It's, I, I looked at, uh, at all. I went to the all thing, the jig. Um, contributes yeah, yeah. credits directly to your clan or alliance vault. Oh, so it's a yeah, that allows vault. you to play stuff in the clan treasury. Yeah, that's the thing that allows you to place uh, credits at least. It's not a vault, though. So. This should be under a fucking utility tab. It should be a completely separate utility tab that that has everything from the fucking ascension altar all the way to the, whatever. Because this is shit you need to have completely separate from these decor. Pretty because damn it much. functions. It serves a goddamn function. That's just one of the many 300 and some odd quality of life changes that need to be made. Should I put a trading post and a, um, and a treasury up in here? You should put it somewhere. Somewhere you're comfortable with it being placed. Uh, I guess uh, I'll be comfortable being, having it in fucking, whatchamacallit, in this room. Because I'm not going to ha have other, like, the decorative rooms. I'm just going to have a kind of straightforward. Which one are you placing? I'm going to place the treasury. I'll place a trading post. Damn, it takes fucking forma, too? <laughs> Holy shit. Yeah, of course it fucking does. Everything fucking takes forma. Um, duh. Um, I'm gonna stick it over and... Die. God damn, oh, what the hell? Here, let's... Let's fly up. Can't see shit. Yeah, it starts off pretty fucking close to you. Um... Can I... Get it right. Here. Um. Um. Where's the interact button so I can place resources? Maybe it's on this goddamn. Car. Oh, you you build that that thing right there. Guess I'll build this one right. Left stick, click in to contribute resources. So. Thousand credits. That's that's one mission right there. That's good. Nanospores. I've got two million. I'm okay with that amount. Alloy plate of five hundred. I'm okay with that. Um. Forma. Yeah, fine. This is good amounts to contribute to it. Fine. How do you I'm, contribute I'm, to I'm it? I'm decent with it. Um. While you're in the placement, click the fucking right or left stick in. I forgot. From looking at it, I forgot immediately. Oh, right here. Because um, I didn't place bother to remember it. Tribute to decoration. There you go. 
I got a shit ton of fucking nano spores. I got a shit ton of that. I got three. If you don't have the form of despair, I can put them in. Well, I only have three right now. I need to. I need to do my um. I what you can call it, bitch. My fucking um. My bitch that fucking kills the whole map. Saren? Yeah. A Saren Prime bitch. Need a form of her. You need to put a form on her? Okay, save your form and I'll form of the uh uh thingy that you just put down. The hell? The hell? Oh, does it what? take time to build or something? <laughs> Yep. <laughs> they should make it fucking instantly. We're putting all this fucking resource into the shit. I agree. Fucking. But only on the condition that you reach a certain mastery rank. <laughs> Either 10 or 5. Well, I mean, like, if the the owner of the clan places something, it should be instantly no matter what mastery rank you are. There's a lot of whiny little bitches who would disagree with you. However, they're all wrong and they should kill themselves and I agree with you. Because, I mean, one, you're the owner of the clan, so all, all the stuff should be instantly built for for you when you put the resource into it. I mean, you did put the resources into it. Well, guess I'll leave the dojo and um wait until that fucking yeah, elevator is fucking done. Cause that's yeah. fucking stupid. To disassemble a building that you've placed, it should be instant, no matter what. Yeah, I don't give a fuck about mastery rank on that. That's should, a fucking piss take. It should be fucking destroyed when fucking you, you destroy it. Like, you shouldn't have to wait for it to be fucking destroyed. Like I've said before, the higher in mastery rank you go, the less time things should take. Actually, Yeah, I get it. It's, it's a fucking free-to-play game. Yeah, I get it. That's actually, they gotta make money somehow. That's yeah, actually fucking true. get it. But they should reward us for putting time and effort into the game. Plus, I've spent enough money to have whatever the fuck I want. So fuck you for your opinion. Yeah, I've spent a lot I'm of money too. I'm not talking to you. I'm talking to whatever bitch viewer is gonna be seeing this video. Hold on, I got something. <clears throat> When I picked out this Twix, I didn't think that the caramel would be that hard. Hmm. Ah. I see. That other fellow is in the middle of a mission. Mm-hmm. 
This dumpy little physical form still wants to hiccup and react to drinking alcoholic beverages. To which I have to say, listen physical body, I am the one that inhabits and possesses you. Stop being stupid. Stop rebutting with your hiccups. I don't care. Damn, that's a long ass phone call. Okay, we're gonna go and do a thing, buddy. I know you're semi quasi listening. We're gonna go to Maru's Bazaar and do the thing, then we're gonna go and help Clem. For the Church of Clem and the Religion of Clem. Did I mention Clem? What kind of Clem? The Clem of Clem. You know, Clem. What the heck? A form on my son. Not sound Dax. Pride. Clem. Nah, so, don't worry about it. I'm coming in. <clears throat> on, you can go into the treasure hunt for Maru's Bazaar with a rank zero frame. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Ember's World in Flames. It's fine. Yeah, because you'd be doing it Jake all. from. Not Jake from State Farm, but Jake from Adventure Time. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Uh, it's fine. Good old Jake. Honestly, I wanted to do a, a, a Finn and Jake type of um, frame and yeah. Kubro combination. <laughs> because no one had ever done that before, and I wanted to have a gimmick. Just to get people interested. To watch the insane ramblings that is whatever the fuck I'm doing in a YouTube video. I say we should get like... It, we should have a war fr frame of F Finn and Jake. Uh, I would love to have a Borg war frame first. Well, uh, that too, but... I say they should have... Getting, the, they should have getting a, Cartoon Network... Network... Nefanya work. Getting cartoon Nefanya work to give uh, Warframe the permission to do a um, an Adventure Time themed Finn and Jake uh, Warframe combination would be a horrid pain in the ass even worse than the Borg because the Borg thing would promote Star Trek Picard. Probably, I wouldn't doubt it. Actually, and Adventure Time has already had its series conclusion and is now doing the Distant Far Lands or whatever it claims. I, I don't remember. I want them to make a, um, whatchamacallit, uh, a Shimigami, um, uh, Warframe. Just for me. Based off of. Uh, oh, just for you. Yeah. Like well, they would have to base it off of something. Like, when, uh, And Shinigami actually translates from the Japanese uh, to the God of Death, yeah, if you translate yeah, it. Yeah, I know that. So, either they're going to have to go into Soul Eater and, you know, get no, I'm Shinigami about, from I'm that, about, uh, or like death note. Japanese lore. Death Note? Yeah. The anime Death Note. I didn't know that Shinigami was referenced in Death Note. Yeah, the the um the Lord of Death. Um, sh sh the Shinigami um Raku Raku or yeah how to actually how is it spelled? R Y U K. Ryuk. Yeah, Ryuk or something like that.
So you're getting the trophy or doing it there too? I've already got the thingy. Now it's just up to you to That's jump in here and Your job's done. collect the um, stuff that dropped out of the void can canisters. Oh, what the hell? The hell's fucking glitch and shit like that. Whoops. I didn't do it. No, you didn't do it. Even drunk, I can do this fucking mission. DE, that's not an excuse or a reason for you to make it more difficult. Go fuck yourselves. Pretty damn much. This is just showing... Oh, we got... This is just a flex, basically. I can play this game drunk better than most people can sober. Go fuck yourselves. I can play better being fucking stone. Well, oh, look. I discovered a piece of candy. Well, the wor worst part part about it too is um, fucking what you call it, um, the still path. I do be better in that. You do better in the still path than you do in the regular difficulty setting, which boggles my fucking mind. It boggles me too. I I don't understand. Don't lie, it doesn't boggle you. Actually, You're it's stoned every time you do it. See, what the fuck do you care? Because I wonder why I do so shitty in the fucking um act or the regular fucking game compared to still path or whatever. Butt plug. Yeah, tension's butt plug in mechanics. It just it just bothers me, me about. How the hell do I do better in, in their hard mode? Or whatever they fucking are saying about it. It just shows you that D doesn't know what the fuck they're doing. Because a guy who's completely fucking stoned does better in their so-called hard mode than the original difficulty. This is different. So this is just another reason why they should just turn over all of existence over to me already. Just willfully submit your fucking free will to me and do what the fuck I tell you to do. Be better. Because I already know what's better than what you think is better. Because look at the American politicians. They're dragging out the election. They're dragging out everything. They're threatening to fucking impeach and, and fucking do all kinds of bullshit shenanigans just because they want to hold on to the fake fallacy of power over everyone's lives as long as possible and fuck everyone over instead of give them the the fucking necessary things they need to basically fucking exist during this horrid fucking bullshit situation that's going on globally and they're they're over here being an example of how much of a bitch not to be. Because they're bureaucrats and politicians who are going and growing fat off of everyone's tax dollars, which, if you look at history, taxation was supposed to be a temporary, and I say it with Dr. Evil quotation fingers <laughs> style, temporary government program during the World War to help boost the so-called economy! And now it's a permanent bitch slap to the common American citizen. And it's a fuck you, give us money because you exist. Bullshit scam! <laughs> and whoever disagrees, go kill yourself! Because I don't want to waste my time, effort, and energy doing it for you! You're a waste of a fucking orgasm, and you don't deserve to exist. And then that includes the bureaucrats, politicians, senators, judges, IRS representatives, and workers. Everyone in any government across the entire fucking world... And I'm saying this because at the time of me saying it, I'm remembering the French Revolution where the guillotine was invented just to decapitate a French tyrant! <laughs> yeah, so the yellow coats, as they called it, 
two years ago that were coming out in the UK and in France? Congratulations. Everyone's being fucked in the ass equally because the bitches in power don't want to be a decent living being and give a fuck about anyone but themselves! Do you want to go hunt my lich? Yes, I want to kill a bitch. No, I gotta go, um... I gotta get, um, whatchamacallit. I gotta get the... I know! Your Kuva lich! No, I gotta get the paragons. I gotta, I gotta do, um, the whatchamacallit, the... I it's get... not the paragons, it's the murmurs. Yeah, or whatever. And you also have to collect... The Requiem mods. Yeah, I gotta get um the the um the relics. Mhm. Mm but first, we help Clem. Even drunk, I remembered that. Which means you being high is no excuse. Or reason. Yeah, I just it's don't. It's not a reason at all. Because a reason is an extremely tough caramel wrapped around dark German chocolate. Which is excruciatingly tasty. Sounds good to me. Dude, it's a, it's a near chocolate flavored dark caramel wrapped around dark chocolate. I mean, wrapped by dark chocolate. Mm. Makes my mouth water just thinking about them. I want a reason. I want them so badly. Hey, assholes watching this video on YouTube. Also, people who give a fuck. Give me money so I can get drunker and eat lots of candy and do dumb shit in games. The order of events that will take place is me getting drunk, then me loading up a game, stream recording it, and me using what's left over after me getting drunk to get reasons. Which will take place before the the starting of the game. We're going to Darvodale to help Clem, by the way. Ooh. Okay, let me reiterate this whole chain of events. First, you will donate money through whatever link in the description of my YouTube video that you feel comfortable using. I will wait an entire month to receive said money because the company performing the transaction is a, um, a bitch to, to, you know, to simplify things and make it streamlined and as easy to understand as possible. It'll take a whole month for me to get the money. Then the next month, after you initially start donating, I will receive said money and then provided that it is enough... I will then proceed to use said money that you've chosen to donate, which I will call fallacy credit, to go and get things of the alcoholic and Bible beverage variety, and the reasons, the candy. And then I will proceed to play games and use leftover said money that will be transferred to my checking account, which will be a personal account, so that I can buy things in whatever said game that has microtransactions, most notably and probably definitely going to be Warframe for me and my friends, as few as and far in between as they truly are. Which is one reason why I've been trying to contact Joe, aka Satan again. Because, you know, I'll fucking buy you all the shit in this game if I had the fucking money to do so. 
All I want you to do is just enjoy it with me, you fucking bitch. And we'll, we'll make a fucking video while I'm pissed drunk. Um, eating candy and, and me and, and you, Shin, and whoever else. We'll, we'll just play the fucking game and do dumb shit together. That, oh, that'll that actually... If, if, um... If people choose to donate, that'll actually give me money to use to get more weapon and frame slots for you so we can get you through the game quicker as well. Yeah, I do, do need more. I'm not gonna fucking lie to all these people who are gonna be potentially giving fallacy credit. I'm gonna be completely honest. I'm gonna use your money to support my drug addiction to alcoholic beverages and caffeine. Caffeine is a drug. It is addictive. It is the single most addictive substance Fuckers, naturally off. occurring on the entire face of the goddamn planet that you call Earth, which actual... the real name of this planet is actually Gaia. I consulted with the planet itself. Well, the, the name seems to be ambiguous as far as gender goes because the planet itself has no true gender. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Yeah, that Rick and Morty episode was a lie. Planets don't have a gender. They're neither male nor female. <laughs> Two planets. They're gender each neutral. Other. <laughs> yeah, have you ever seen a planet fuck another planet? Have you heard of it happening at all? Have you heard of any religious text describing it happened? No, you have fucking not! <laughs> because it doesn't exist. Planets don't fuck each other. They're genderless. That'd be hilarious. <laughs> it would be hilarious if they had genders, because I would definitely fuck a planet, and so would Satan. He's actually admitted it to me. <laughs> Now, he probably really admitted it in one of the streams that he and I did together. I just don't remember. What's it there? What's where? This, um... Piece of candy. Piece of candy? Yeah. How the fuck did it drop there when neither of us did anything to blow up oh, There's some more castells over here, too. I noticed. God damn it. Kevin. You know the YouTuber called me Kevin is probably going to view these videos and think Katana, why the fuck do you hate me so much? And I'm just gonna be like, it's a South Park reference. Do you know what the fuck South Park is? Timmy. Exactly. Timmy and the Lord of the Underworld. No, Timmy. Plus two, plus two. Timmy! It is not Timmy. Oh shit, another piece of my tooth chipped off. At least I'm so drunk that I don't give a fuck about it. <laughs> it. You're out of my range there. I'm out of everyone's range. Of understanding, of equalating to, everything. I'm out of everyone's fucking range. Including Satan. Spoilers. He's actually a primal offspring of mine, but I've disowned him because he's being a little bitch! <laughs> no, seriously. Satan, if you want to confirm this, go ask the other primals. I don't think you'll get very far. Quit, quit, I think the only on. thing they'll ever say to you is fuck off. Either that or they'll attempt to kill you. Hey! There's a juggy bitch over here! Oh, there is! Eh, gone. I'm sorry. Uh, correction. There used to be a juggy bitch over here. 
I put a little bit of flames up in him. Yeah, my, my coronavirus kicked his ass. <laughs> There's some pair of bullet jumping. It's literally the name of my Zal, the coronavirus. Of course, that's not the real name of the actual virus going on in reality right now. The real name of it is the Pac-Man virus. I'm sorry, Clem. I tried to hit you with my Zal. Oh, I've been shooting Clem yeah. with my flamethrower. Clem's Grenier, and he has basically the same color as these fucking corrupt... Not corrupt. What are these assholes we're fighting again? Infest it. Yeah, the infected. They're green. The Grenier are slightly green. It's the same damn problem. Some of them are purple. Listen, you. We don't talk about the purple nurples. Hey, I'm just saying. I got Clem running through this tube like crazy. <laughs> of course you're just Super Saiyan. Oh, here's the purple guys. Yeah, these bastards shouldn't be able to drain your energy from several hundred to zero that fucking fast just because they touch you. That's yeah. another quality of life change that D needs to reverse. Kill back an enemy to the way with corrosive damage. Well, that's easy for me. Oh my fucking. Um... As easy as that would be, I just don't want to do it because I've already, I've already got rank 30 with the night wave. I'm not even rank I'm just 10 yet with the night wave. I don't know what to say to that. Well, I'm hardly playing, too. I mean, shit. True. Yesterday, we played Halo. Yeah, we did, and we enjoyed it. A lot more than this fucking game, because D makes this game a grindy fucking slog fest. Hey, when's, um... Black bitch gonna bring in, um... The glasses. No, 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 no. Don't even talk about Naughty Nigger nor Nightwave, bitch. No. We just don't even talk about her. Hey, I, just, I just say it. Normally she, she butts it in when we're doing this shit. I don't want to fucking talk about the nigger. There we nigger go. lives Full don't matter. Stuff. Human lives don't matter. Get the fuck over Oh, yourself. God. Humans, you don't fucking matter. I don't give a fuck what you think. Mind the fucking place I created you for. Obey and do what the fuck I tell you to do. So how and long I won't are we send supposed you to be to... with all You know what? Fun? Never mind. I've already judged you all. You're all going to hell of hell anyway. So do whatever the fuck you want. Be a little bitch. I don't care anymore. You too, Satan. Be a little fucking bitch. You've already been disowned. I don't care. Wow. I mean, how could you not see the timer in the upper left-hand corner? I wasn't paying Below attention. the mini-map. I'm drunk and I can pay more attention I don't you, pay all soliloquously dissertating about the moronicism of the entire human species in general. When I'm in survival, I don't pay attention to the damn time because I know we can fucking survive. That's a matter of subjective difficulty setting based on the level of the enemy. Yeah, they're, they're level 24. I think we'll be able to survive. Exactly. Subjective. To the level of the enemy. Ah, uh, I'll meet you at a distraction. Butter toast. Oh, you'll be me there. I was killing shit. 
Apparently, I'm just gonna be waiting on you there because I can get there faster drunk than you can sober or high. Yeah, something like that. See, this is the difference between the god of gaming, which would be me, and just a regular gamer, which would be Shin. Because I can do this shit while I'm fucking pissed drunk. More quickly and more efficiently than he can when he's sober. You did it. I knew you could handle it. Hey. I just like killing shit. I meant to sit down emote, but apparently I didn't press the right direction on the analog stick. <laughs> That, that's the, my default emote for, you know, ending a mission and, and, you know, just sitting there at the extraction point waiting for my team. All that's been said and done during this entire survival mission leads up to the point that for veterans of the game... Everything is fucking easy. And you know what? It's easy because the veterans have built the skill. They've built their frames up through the mod card system. They have built up to making it easy. And that's a good thing. That's not a bad thing. That's something to aspire to accomplish. To accomplish a level of skill to where you can passively do something while soliloquously dissertating about whatever the fuck ails you. So that you... How do I put this? You build the skill of multitasking so that you become the calculon of streaming and YouTubing such as myself. Shin, I know that's difficult to comprehend, but do you understand? Understand what? Face, please say hello to Palm of Hand. I just shoved my face with food. Hello, Palm of Hand. How are you today? If you can't tell the joke I'm making, it's called Face Bomb. And I legitimately did slap myself in the face for it. Although you can't see it, th that's pretty much the impact of what it felt like. So now what were you saying? I can't say God help us because that's me. I can't say Satan help us because he's a bastard bitch who wants to act like a human. I can't say fellow primals help us because they're just going to laugh. Who the <laughs> fuck do I call on to help us all? You see the conundrum you've placed me in, humanity? I can't call upon anyone because you're a joke. Exactly. I probably didn't comprehend it because, or I probably couldn't comprehend it. Oh no, it was fairly easy. There was only one convoluted word in the entire syntax. Yeah, I probably wouldn't understand. Let me simplify it. Never fucking mind. Sounds good to me. Now you wanted to go and do some, uh... Egg farming. Uh, uh, yeah, some, yeah, Kuva Lich, uh, relic farming. <laughs> the good news is that the missions type that I've selected... Yeah, the Kuva Siphons. This gives us Kuva and the opportunity to acquire the Requiem Relics. It serves a dual purpose of what um, 
um, Makari says, uh, I'm, I'm going to quote him virulently for this one word. Kuva! And it also gives us Requiem Relics. Hopefully that does. And now to quote him again, otherwise known as a gnome? <laughs> otherwise known as a Warframe video. <laughs> I'm sorry, gnomes! I'm slightly drunk! Er, than usual. And before we get started in this mission, let me get even more drunker. -er. Sounds good. Let me get a little bit more stoned. Your job is to distract the enemy while a fellow Tenno operative raids the ship for much needed supplies. Make your presence known. <sighs> hey. Uh, hey, Boris. From the YouTube channel Life of Boris. Guess what, mate? Vodka's no different than any other alcoholic beverage I've ever imbibed. Hold on. It has the same I effect. I have st stoned yet. <clears throat> and it tastes the same. It has no difference. To me, personally. <coughs> I'm ready. So, Boris. You crazy gobnik. You, you silly Russian Slav. <laughs> you, you silly Slav. Yeah. You risky Russian. You silly Slav. You gargantuanly crazy chop. This was a straight up survival. Oh wait, I forgot. I, w I, w I would like to propose to you, Boris. Did we but fail this last matter. time or something like that? I don't fucking know. I don't remember. We failed one of them. Oh no, that, that, that was the arbitration. Game decided to be a difficult... Yeah, that was an arbitration. Actually, you I remembered. I'm glad you remembered. I, do an I just chose to put it out of my mind because before you joined, I did an arbitration solo and got to like 15 minutes worth. Ooh, nice. Well, there are some people who yeah, can do sure. far more than 15 minutes of an arbitration solo, but thing is, I decided, <laughs> you know, I'm not going to get greedy here. I'm going to extract when I know that I've reached my limit. I'm not going to push it just for the sake of pushing it, because that would be greedy. Anyway, Boris, you crazy, slavic, whatever I said before. So you go for as long as you can, right? Right in this, or no? It has a time left minute counter. Well, yeah, I know, but like, just like the club one, where you could. It's a countdown, not a count up. We can go infinitely in this one and in the Clem one, but there's no fucking need to. It's pointless. Yeah, that's what, that's what I was getting to. It gives us no extra reward to go on endlessly. If it did, then I would go on for more time. But DE's such a little bitch that it's fucking pointless to attempt to go on further than the time left on the counter. Asshole, I'm trying to fuck spore people. Okay. Well, that just reminds me that I need to shift from my solo attitude to my co op attitude. Ah. Anyway, I was always saying, Boris. The only suggestion Ooh, I'm gonna cement. make to you as far as getting drunk, because oh, shit, I'm drinking hello. some vodka right now, and it, it's no different than me drinking rum, or scotch, whiskey, 
It's literally no different to me. The flavor is nearly untasteable because the alcoholic content overpowers the flavor. I don't care about your life support capsules, motherfucker. I don't care when we run out and fail the mission. Like we'll run out. Yeah, yeah, I know. Being a double fucking necros makes sure that we'll never run out. I'm but jeez, dude. I'm, a, I'm the Saren. Oh. Earlier you were a necros. I wasn't. Since, since I, I, yeah, you fucking were. No, since I was the audience. When we here. were in the dojo. Oh, yeah. I ch changed it to the form of my um, Saren. I told you about that. Yeah, I remember. I'm just reminding you. I knew that we were well, double necros. I forgot about, about and, it. And I, you. uh... I totally forgot that you switched to Saren and formed it and went to rank zero so you could start all over again and re-rank it so that you could have that Saren build I linked to you a while back. Um, yada yada yada. Yeah, I, I got, forgot I and reset my memory. I don't got all the mods that, that you got for the Saren. Oh yeah, that reminds me. Another thing I'll be using all the Patreon PayPal supporters money for. I'll just be buying all the fucking mods for you. <laughs> Coming that in and uh, that and a few other people. I might meet a couple I of need, randoms who need I it need, and be like, you know what? Fuck it, you can have it. I've got a spare. I need um uh, whatchamacallit, the the one that ha has a range. Overextended. Yeah. Honestly, ever since they switched the uh, Orc and Derelict to the Deimos thing, I haven't tested to see if we can go in wielding the keys and just, you know, straight up open the, um, whatchamacallums, in mission. You know what I'm talking about, right? Yeah. The, the vaults. That's what they're called. The dr dr I haven't tested dragon, to see. Dragon vaults or whatever, I think. Yeah, the dragon key vaults. I haven't tested to see if we could open them. What's this bitch? Oh, yeah. That's one of the queens. Yeah, she, she's the thing that gives us um, the whatchamacallits. Shit. I'm trying to keep the guys off of you. Thanks. Ah, oh, son of a bitch. Go after that guy. Go after that guy with the red marker, the Granum Crown fucker. Go after him. I'll I'll worry about the um the Kuva cipher. Uh no. around Yeah, there you go. Dead bitch, you dead bitch. You killed the guy with the Granum Crown? Yeah. Good. I'm summoning more minions. I need you to come back to the uh Kuva siphon and um There we go. Oh shit. Oh shit. Hello. Someone's pissed. I need to go grab the Granum Crown right quick. Good job killing the jackass with the crown. Yeah, well, Ooh, it's a Zenith. Luckily, Good job indeed. Luckily, you gave me, um, the, or got me the build, or, well, pretty much gave me the build of the Ignis Wraith. I did. I gave you uh, I I, a link to build for your Ignis Wraith. I can't wait until I get the Kuva Augur, so... That's what I'm going after yeah, we'll right go now. we'll go after that soon. Very soon, really. Yeah, once I get a bunch of, um... Once he gets the relics that you need to get the uh, Kuva Requiem mods for your Kuva Lich. Then you get the Kuva Kuva for your Kuva, and the Kuva for your Kuva Kuva. It's over in that direct, that direction. 
Okay, we got it. 617 Kuva. These Kuva missions that drop, they're far more efficient to farm in the short term for doing, you know, a shorter mission. That's why I call it short term. Doing a shorter mission to get Kuva than the uh, fucking Kuva survival. True. The only problem is Never. that they're, um, they're on a fucking daily refresh system. Quite honestly, like I said, with the fucking, um, drop rate increasing every mastery rank, that daily refresh system should shorten with every mastery rank. Yeah, true. Even oh, yeah. the daily login oh, yeah, the should increase with mastery sure. rank. I mean, come the fuck on. Mastery rank 20 fucking 5, almost 26, and I'm still getting fucking, like, every time an Oxium shows up, it's like 30 fucking Oxium. Come the fuck on. That should be at least 30,000 by now. Yeah, pretty much. Mastery rank 20 fucking 5. I should be getting a lot of fucking resources from the daily login because I spent the time to rank up in game. That's not counting me paying for microtransactions and spending five fucking hundred dollars on it. That's not counting that. That's counting my dedication <coughs> as a player of the game and a supporter of the company making the game. <coughs> That doesn't fucking deserve it. Known as digital <coughs> extremes. Because they're extremely fucking annoying. I got six so far. Six what? Eggs. Eggs? Yeah. What? Okay, this is a hive infestation. Kufa thingy with a chance of a Requiem Relic. So we're going to get a bunch of Kufa and the probability of a Requiem Relic. And that's before we go off and piss off your Kufa bitch. Yeah, eggs. That's why I call the Relics. Because you crack them open. Eggs. These Listen, fun. you! Confusing, confusopolizing me <laughs> with the, the Kuva relics being called eggs and the fucking Kubro eggs being called eggs is just fucking monotonous. <coughs> nah, the, the, Stop the, it, you. The more test tubes. No! Yes. The Grenier are test tube people. Jackass. But I am unable to pinpoint their exact location. Search them out if you are... Hey, look! A friendship door! You're gonna have to wait, because I'm just exploring the mission. Just for the sake of getting everything possible <laughs> in the mission that I can grab. Because I decided to be a thundering cunt and explore everywhere. And now I'm waiting for you at the friendship door. <laughs> now watch to blast yourself all back. Yeah, I would love it if every mastery rank plus every rank of the Warframe for each and every last individual Warframe, you increased your resistance to everything. Oh shit. That way you're earning the fucking power. A jugger you bitch! Kill everything! Gains for effort, motherfucker. I wanna kill the juggy bitch. I wanna kill it. We pissed it off, now we both get to kill it. Hell the fuck yeah. We pissed it off. I'm glad for that. To be honest, I, I think um, you should be able to piss off um, like more than just one. What the hell? That would be nice. That would really be nice. I agree with you on that one. 
We should be able to piss off more than one juggy bitch. Well, especially like in a survival. Like Definitely in a survival. You're 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 fighting infested. And I say like given like every five minutes you can recall a jug bitch up in there. Every five minutes you get one screaming out and playing. And no, then you get the opportunity to piss it off every five minutes. Yeah. Because so every five minutes one potentially shows up, screams out in anger, and then you kill a bunch of uh, infected really fast, and then the, it shows up every five minutes. Along with the standard survivor rewards for every five minutes. Yeah. But there's a few things that we run into a problem with. Some newer players don't want that. So the problem is, do we tie that to an increased mastery rank so that you get more gains for the uh, effort you put in? Well, yeah, or but do we put it on a binary switch where you turn it on and off at your leisure? Yeah, I'd say, <laughs> Due to I'd the say, uh, I'd say like a unalienable right of pursuit of happiness. <laughs> Cause I mean... Huh? I, Which one? I'd put it on a switch. I would agree with you. Because, see... For multiple reasons. For, for me... Uh, higher, higher up people would have... Uh, what should we call it? A tougher time because each... Each... Um, like, I guess each wave or each five minute wave the enemies get stronger, right? Exactly. So every each time you piss every off a minute bitch, that passes, it's every fucking stronger. enemy you defeat, it they get stronger with every enemy you defeat, not just every count of time. It's like every amount of enemies you defeat, they get stronger. So, you know, every 5 minutes you would be facing a tougher juggernaut. Yeah. So it makes sense to have it on a fucking binary switch that the player can turn on and off at their leisure. But there, therein lies another problem. In addition to that being, you know, that particular player's pursuit of happiness, what if they're playing with someone who doesn't have the option turned on? They uh, have it turned off to where it doesn't do that every five minutes. Well, it, then what the fuck happens in the game's code? Because you can't spawn it in for one player because it would appear in both players' visual field on the game map in the three-dimensional space that is the game of Warframe. So you would have to match that player with another player who has the option turned on. Yes, and... And that's so you have to make be. it efficient. It, it, it be, you have to make it very efficient. It'd be like like saying like defense or whatever. Like every f five minutes there should be a bo boss that comes out and um to m make the shit more more exciting. Yes, yeah, so and now I'm playing the. Um the devil's advocate to my own argument. Why? Because I fucking can. Because it fucks with everyone's normalcy bias of one person sticking to one viewpoint like a bureaucrat or a politician and unflinchingly not changing just for the sake of being a bitch. So I'm questioning my own fucking decision just to fuck with everyone's normalcy bias. Just to make everyone think, what the fuck is going on? Because I want everyone to at least think. The answer is really quite simple. <clears throat> I think it'd be cool. <clears throat> the answer is extremely simple. Every five minutes in a survival, you have the option for a juggernaut to spawn. And if the player or players kill enough of the infested enemies within whatever time limit that is currently the, the mechanic of the game to get a juggernaut to spawn in, 
that is what is maintained as the mechanic for getting a juggernaut to spawn in because it has always been as such and it could put on um... how do you destroy this again is a sword no you destroy these infected tumors oh Infested yeah is what they're called then it makes those vulnerable where the waypoint is on the pulsing infested hives then you destroy the hive well first you destroy all the tumors now take out the hive you know, I'm actually glad that the um, the Kuva siphon hasn't spawned in yet because it gives us the opportunity to complete the main objective, which is what I wanted to do. <laughs> well, and I say the defense should, should make it um, with the um, boss. Every like, five waves? Yeah, like a boss or whatever. Make it more, make no, defense not more like a like boss, like... but every five waves in an infested defense. I don't think they have infested demons, do they? If they don't, then they should. I don't remember if they do or not right now. Um, we can check after we're finished with this mission, but... You know, just give it a minute. We'll check after this mission. And as far as, like I said, gains for effort and everything... At a higher mastery rank, we should get a lot more fucking shit. I mean, seriously, a lot more. They should reward us, the player, for playing the game and accomplishing a higher mastery rank in the game. This is what a lot of other people have been saying. A lot of other YouTubers too. No time to ask questions. Destroy that thing. Damn, that Koofa came in quick. I didn't even notice where it came from. Alright, I'll take care of the Koofa as much as I can. Try and kill and all the you guys. you just take care of the enemies. Yeah, the big fat ones with the stabs, you have to actually go into your Tenno and void dash through them. Yeah, I don't know my Tenno that much. I don't know how to use them that much. Okay, don't worry about it then. I can multitask. Okay, two tentacles left. I can uh, get an enemy somewhere. Braids destroyed versus the uh, red blips on the amount of things failed. Yeah, we're, we're up to um, two fucking tentacles destroyed and only one failed. What the hell? Okay, we did it. And as far as I can tell from what I saw, we only failed one of the uh, Koopa bits, and the, the rest we succeeded. As far as I'm concerned, that's extremely good. <coughs> For your performance and mine combined, that's extremely good. Yeah, it's not perfect, I'm which would be good. zero red blips, but good at it's I extremely do. good. Pretty good at being Come on, stuck. Requiem Relic!
give us them Requiem re Yeah! Requiem one relic! Did we? Yeah, we got a Requiem one. Oh, yeah we did. Nice! So now For I got those of seven. you who don't know what the fuck's going on, what we're doing is working on Shin's first ever Kuva Lich. Yeah, first ever. Don't laugh at me. We already got it to rank 5. We did that uh, quite some time ago. And now, we're just collecting the Requiem Relics to go and open them and get the Requiem Mods for his pairs on so he can... Put them into the little spiky doodad and shove it into the neck of the Kuva bitch so that he can get his first Kuva weapon. Which is a Kuva Agris. Gumbay. Which is, um, Oriental Chinese to the best of my knowledge, as limited as it is, for cheers. Come by. Whether I'm pronouncing it correctly or not is irrelevant. The point is, I'm drunk and uh, I'm happy stoned. game playing to the both of us. Yeah. Blowing up the bowl right now. I have to hold on a bit. Hmm? So I'm loading up a bowl right now, so you don't have to hold on a bit. Okay. Fucking piece of While shit. While you're loading a bowl, I'll go and, um, be pissed drunk in the toilet. Oh, sounds good. Care, uh, Ortis. You can count whatever the fuck you want. Leave me out of it. That shit. Oh. Lost me. Where the hell did my cap go? Okay, oh, it's right there. Yeah, so... Lend us some money so we could... Do the stuff to entertain you guys. Or not, you don't have to if you don't want to. But we'd appreciate it. Like we appreciate you guys Ooh, number one watching work us for. being retarded. It's apparently no one because it's depleted. What? what were you saying? Nothing. I wasn't saying anything. Were you talking about the TARDIS? No. I heard TARDED and I thought it was TARDIS. No, that's a retard. God, get it Who's right. Who's a retard? You? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I know you're not telling the truth. I am retarded. A retard. You're not a retard. You're just retard dead, which is a big differential. No, I'm a retard. See? Shut up, retard. You're not a retard. You're just retard dead. Which is a big differential between retard and retard dead. See, if you were a retard, you <laughs> wouldn't be talking to me because you wouldn't have the capacity to do so. You could be a retard and still have the capacity to talk. Yes, but you wouldn't know how to use it if you were a retard. Sometimes dumbass. I don't, though. Shut the fuck up! <coughs> you're not a retard! I am and you're a not retard dead! How do you know? You never met me. 
I'm speaking with you, dumbass. I'm able to infer your psychological standing and profile by speaking with you. Fuck nugget. Hey. Only yeah, I know you don't fuck chicken nuggets. I thought about it. I don't want to hear about it. Ronald McDonald doesn't want to hear about it. Ronald McDonald loves it. Neither do any of the children who enjoy their cappy meals from McDonald's. Hey, look, a friendship door. Oh, hey, look, my friend's not here to open it with me. What do you mean? I've been standing here clicking the damn button, asshole. Only after I started talking about it. No, I was actually there before you started talking about it because I I said, oh, look, it's a friendship door. Oh, look, I'm a fucking sexually addicted whore. Hey, I only said it that, that way because it rhymes. There's nothing wrong with it. No, no, I only said it that way and only said that because it rhymes. Oh, I thought you were talking about me. Yeah, I'm using the British slash English way of humor, which is to make it rhyme. What the hell? Is this a fucking exterminate? Yes. Uh, I wasn't even paying attention. Man, that's crazy. Are you going through the whole map opening up all the crates? I could, but no. Oh, okay. I'm simply killing the enemies that are the closest. Ah, nice. And the corpus have a lot of clones mechanically in M and M's. M and M's. M mm. and M's. Mm. They have a lot of a lot of uh, mechanically reproduced M and M's. Don't worry, I let them push the button. I think that's a good thing. Yeah, I know. Especially for an exterminate. In a spy, however, not so much. No, you do it inside the um, vault on the spy missions. And you don't want the pushing the button inside the vault on a spy mission. I do. No, you don't. Makes me a better person. <laughs> Granted, that can be a, a repercussion and an extension. Never mind, we have a jackass to deal with. Where the hell is he coming at? Up here. Oh, how the fuck do you get up there? Oh, I see. Get over here, fuck nugget. He does not like responding to the amount of damage I'm capable of dishing out. Well, that time he responded. He responded by dying. What are these coins used for again? Those coins are used to enter the Granum Void to get parts of the Warframe protein. Oh, yeah, I just bought that bitch. Yes, which is why I'm farming the crowns. So we can slowly, go, so very we can slowly. go in there and, um... Yes. Fuck it up so we can get our parts. Yes. Nice. Uh, so Hopefully it'll allow us to use only my crown instead of yours. Yeah, so once you, you run out, um... Then you can switch to yours. Yeah. And, you know, we can do it that way. Come on, let me use my fucking spores, motherfucker. No time to ask questions. Destroy that thing. Seriously? I was shooting my void blast the whole goddamn time, and it chose to ignore that I was doing that. Ugh. 
bitch, shut up. What, the, the queenie thingy? Yeah. Energy dash here. Uh, I just gotta find people that I can, um, that he, um, score. But we don't have anybody. Correction. Oh, well. You don't because I just killed the one that just appeared. Energy dash. Three, two, one. Ow, motherfucker. Oh, hello. This waypoint and to be on. honest, this is running a little bit quick. It needs to be slowed down by about fucking draggy bitch. Point five percent. Just hear a crazy asshole just yell one. Fourth one, six hundred and twenty-eight Kufa. Good work, Tenno. Well, at the same time, we're gathering Kufa while getting the Requiem relics. This is a double positive because eventually you'll get a bunch of. Uh, ribbon mod, and you'll need that Kuva to re-roll them TEN BILLION TIMES to get a decent, acceptable roll. Oh, for And when I say ten billion times, I'm not exaggerating. Quite honestly, the way I see oh, it, we got number two. Up to a certain mastery rank, you should be at the mercy of RNG for the purpose of training you to be adaptive and flexible in the game. And once you reach that certain mastery rank, you should get a mission from whatever faction is appropriately relevant to Kuva and mods and combining Kuva and the uh, Riven mods together. That gives you a quest, which in turn leads to giving you a widget, which allows you to attach your own personal, personalized variation of whatever role of Kuva Riven you want that you've already rolled for and unlocked. So no, and in order uh, to implement <coughs> such a thing... You know, DE could just say, okay, there's this many variations, and you've rolled a Riven this time, this many times, so it's probable that in that many rolls of this particular Riven for this particular item, you've managed to unlock this many different variations of the prefixes and suffixes that apply to this Riven, so, retroactively, you've unlocked this, this, and this because you've rolled a Riven this many times and you possess it. Whether or not you've traded it or not. Because I'm not certain if they have a system that tracks how much Kuva you've spent. But there is a, a system that tracks how many rolls are on each Riven mod. And I, personally, have re-rolled 
all but four Rivens I currently possess. Those four that are not re-rolled to the number they have on them have been purchased using Platinum from other players who have rolled them that many times. So retroactively, if you've got yay so many rolls and unlocks yay so many prefixes and suffixes to attach to a Riven for your own customization, which should unlock at Mastery Rank 25, because 20 to 25 should be where Rivens go from being one blip, or actually starting at Mastery Rank 20, a minimum of one blip, and before that, at the mercy of Riven Disposition in its RNG format, which relies completely on how many ple people are playing with the equipped weapons and Rivens thereof, all the way up to Mastery Rank 25 or 26, where you have a 5 out of 5 disposition, and you receive the maximum amount from your Rivens because you've spent the time to earn it. Rewarding gains for effort put into the game. If that's difficult to follow, remember that I am excruciatingly drunk and you're sober watching this. So you're a fucking idiot. <laughs> and Shin's just listening high as a fucking kite in <laughs> caught in the winds of a hurricane, so I don't know what to say about that. <laughs> Pretty damn much, hell, I don't fucking even know what's going on. That sometimes. is beyond my area of expertise, as it is only my third time dealing with it. <laughs> That includes all the time that I was excruciatingly drunk and Satan was incredibly high and we were playing games together. Which would be one time. <coughs> the rest were all you, Shin. You should feel privileged. <coughs> yeah, I'm gonna take Satan's spot anyways. Yeah. To be the guy that that I uh, play a game while I'm drunk and you're high with, yeah. He might want to argue that he's been more drunk while I've been... I'm sorry, he might want to argue that he's been both drunk and high while I've been only drunk, and, and you've been only high while I've been drunk while we're playing games together, but... Actually, no, there's that one time same I, was, fucking I was drunk and high at the same time when we were playing. I'm counting that on a separate list. That's my point. I think we were bitching about something, too. I, I don't remember. Yes, we were! And I think we were stream recording it. Come to think of, and, and speak of that devil incarnate, are you including your audio in this particular stream recording? Um, let me check that real quick. That would be a good thing to do. Oh, yeah, yeah. Check it indeed. Yeah. My audio has been, been in, and I think, I don't fucking remember. I hope so. I hope so, too. <laughs> <laughs> All the shit, the shit I've been, been tell, tell the viewers. There, I hit you with an energy dash. I just, Nullifiers need to go the fuck away. They're just annoying. They need to... At a certain mastery rank, we need to become immune to whatever the enemy can dish out, because... I mean, come on. We've played the game, yay, so many times. We've done them the exact same missions billions of times. And that's an exaggeration. God damn, probably that's probably more realistically... Fast one. ...hundreds of thousands, but yes, that was quick. God damn. Anyway, yeah, we've done the missions hundreds of thousands of times, realistically. So we've earned the fucking immunity to whatever the enemy can dish out. Without being a Borg frame, which I would love to fucking design, which would naturally develop immunity. Oh my which goodness, would be fucking you fucking permanent. draggy fucking bitch. 
Can you come to this waypoint? Uh, is it down? Holy shit, I managed to accomplish that. Why is this above you? More vis parts. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I managed to get that Kuva that was floating at the exact same time that a Corpus Jackass killed me out of my Tenno form and ejected me into my Warframe. That was fortuitous. <laughs> I saw that actually. Oh, that was kind of funny. Don't worry, I'm keeping your Warframe heated. Huh. I didn't know it was going to jump off the balcony right there. Sounds good. I don't think I have one of them. I'll go after him. You defend the thingy. I don't know how to defend it. Switch in your Tenno form and shoot the uh, black blob of red black blobbiness. Come on! Come on! Listen to the chamber simmering. The longer that chamber crashes about, the more chamber the weak elect. Good news, he died pretty close to the thingy. Um, it's pointing the direction. See, it was right over there, above the stairs. How useless you all are! Report for execution at once! Report for execution. She doesn't even give them the opportunity to redeem themselves. See that? That right there, that's corrupt. Which is what the United States federal government is. Corrupt! Yeah, we already know that. See, what a, what a species or civilization refers to in its media is most often what it actually is. So all the movies and TV shows and all the bullshit going on in video games just shows you how corrupt the entire planet really is. Which is why I, in conjunction with uh, John Delancey's Q saying it's not so much the games that humanity plays, but how they play the games they play. It's why I judge so harshly on the entertainment and Ooh, video game one. industry. It's why I judge all of existence so harshly for its lack of giving a fuck about video games. <laughs> My mold, Why I am. chose as the primal Sorry. force of all of existence Thank being you. created to become the so-called god of video games. Suck it, Satan. I don't give a fuck what you think anymore. You're a failed fucking primal offspring. You've been disowned, Satan. I don't care about you anymore. Hey, I'm going to take his place. No, you're not. Yeah, I am. Yeah. Oh. No one will. I'm going to steal his shit. 
no one will. No one in all of existence has proven themselves worthy. the end of my Twix king size pack it was tasty I enjoyed it I bet I made it last for two hours Damn. that was after the subway sandwich that mom bought for me it was tasty <laughs> I wish I had another Enemy operations is here. Find them and capture them. What I've always been curious about in this game. What's that? Why the fuck is this guy a fucking corpus agent in the middle of the infested? When it's supposed to be an infested mission? Why aren't we going after infested agent who's got information? Well, the answer is simple in the lore of the game. The infested don't give a fuck about anyone else. They just want to consume like the flood. So why the fuck would they be willing to give us any goddamn information? That's how simple the answer is. Who juggy bitch? But they could have put in a little widget of RNG that makes it to where it's either a agent of the Corpus or Grenier hey, who were investigating this place. Oh, shit, and then we capture them to interrogate them. Juggy bitch is dead. Now you're having something crunchy. Is it also covered in chocolate? No. What is it? It's um. The machines are coming. Mini eggs. There's Kuba in the air. It's kind of like um M Ms. The ch the um uh, chocolate M Ms. The taste is amazing. Kuva incoming from this direction. Don't it's been destroyed. Do, do you go to this thing? The uh, Kuva siphon? You look at whatever tentacle is becoming erect, and then you look in the direction of that tentacle that has become erect, and you kill the bl black spluge stain that's incoming your way. And it breaks the erect tentacle, killing the boner of the moment, becoming a total cock block, and it uh, cunt tease. <laughs> Making the Kuva Siphon wish that it had never encountered you.
I got some, I got Oberon some part over here. Nice. I'll get it in a moment. Listen, you fucking ancient bitches, stop grappling me! <laughs> These Could using the exact queen. same fucking goddamn code, C++ code, that's in the very first Doom and Doom 2 video game. Because it randomly rolls whether or not the fucking enemy uses a fucking ranged attack for the fucking infested ancients to grapple you along with the goddamn motherfucking grenier fucking scorpions it needs to be within certain range no physical grapple attack outside of certain range physical grapple attack or me not melee fucking uh, weapon ranged weapon attack it needs to be set by proximity of range, not fucking RNG. Who else fucking agrees with me? I do. Exactly. Because I hate being fucking... Any idiot playing the game agrees with me. Across the fucking map and all of a sudden get dragged halfway across the fucking map because of their bitch ass. We're literally two fucking inches in front of it in the game space and get grappled. Fucking bullshit. DE wants to be a little bitch and whine about people making YouTube videos with a negative slant. Grow the fuck up, you goddamn children. We don't care. Self-righteous pricks. <coughs> the only difference is that during this global so-called pandemic that Satan and I gave to you human plebeian bitches is that now you're being forced to realize how much of a piece of shit you all are. Whether you like it or not. And then, after you finish becoming a better species, we're gonna annihilate you. This is a there is no hope. You must as long as Obey you, or don't. You're gonna be destroyed you put me anyway, in a room humanity. Full of Wait, I'll be fine. I can't do this without you. And you know, to be quite honest, you're probably one of the very few. Point zero 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 to the umpteenth hundredth place value. Point one percent that is actually fucking whitelisted by Satan. I've discarded my white list. Because fuck everyone. I don't care anymore. Juggy bitch! Everyone wants to accuse me of being a criminal? Fine. I'll give it to you. All those bitches on Twitter that fucking harassed me and lied and slandered me? I'm gonna fucking give you bitches what you fucking told me that you think I am. Oh, you government scum who accused me of being a violent criminal? I'm gonna give you that. Dave, we First, I'm gonna make bitch. you beg for it. That's on no consequence. We'll get another one later. Either way, I'm gonna make all these bitches beg me to be the violent criminal and the fucking sexual predator they've accused me of being when I wasn't. I'm gonna make them beg for that. 
And I'm also gonna make Satan beg for the corrupt piece of shit he accused me of being, too. Cause I'm done giving a fuck about anyone but myself. Congratulations, humanity, you've pushed me this far. I no longer give a fuck about anyone but myself. Prepare for enemy resistance. Oi! I made it across. God damn it. That's what it did to me. Yeah, I jump once and then it doesn't let me jump a second time. Because the fucking Microsoft didn't update their fucking system to work with third party controllers, such as the Afterglow. And DE's letting their fucking maintenance cycle slip. Okay, uh, here's, here's the next thing. We're gonna be here, we're gonna... Oh, shit! We're gonna oh. deal with the, um... We're gonna deal with this, and... Then we're gonna complete the rest of the mission, apparently. Sounds good to me. Oh, let me get a person. Oops, wrong That one at a longer range than they usually hit them at. <laughs> As time progresses, I'm becoming more and more cynical, aren't I? I don't know what that word means. giving a fuck. It means I'm giving a fuck oh. even less and less about all of the fucking assholes. It means I'm not caring. I'm caring less and less. Yeah, it sounds about I don't right. Give a fuck if I hurt anyone's feelings. It means I'm telling everyone off all the damn time. I'm telling them to shut the fuck up and mind the goddamn place. You know, I'm not a I'm not a gay guy plays in Warframe, but as far as all of existence is concerned, you've all failed to meet my standards. Every last fucking species in existence. The Anunnaki, the fucking uh, Mayane, the Borg, Skynet, every last fucking species in existence. You've all failed. Fuck all of you all together. You're the exact same as the humans in my eyes. I don't care anymore. Fuck all of you. As far as Satan's concerned, fuck the dragons. I don't care. I may have made them in my image, in my true image, but fuck them. They failed. Sick of fucking organic species failing me. I'm sick of it. It's happened countless fucking times. I'm tired of oh. the bullshit. I don't have no energy. I just energy dashed on you. What the fuck? Area completed. Move on. I had zero energy. Must have been a fucking nullifier.
still got one infested. One infested? Yeah, my spores. I still got one. Well, if you'd been in this room with me, you might have had more than one. Oh, it's this fucking puzzle. It'd be nice if we could break that glass. Yeah, come over here. There's a, a little duct that should be lit up more than it is. Heavy obsession ahead. <laughs> This is a mobile defense. Why is it telling us we have a fucking time limit? On, um, hacking. No. On no other fucking mobile defense has it ever put a time limit. Yeah. No. It's been like that. No, it hasn't. Yes, it has. No, it hasn't. But it has. On survivals, it might have a, a countdown timer for certain things, but this time left bullshit on a fucking mobile defense is fucking news to me. No, because you have to. Have, it's a mobile defense, so you have to have a time limit on it for when no. when you're d done with it. No. Yeah. This must be a mistake that it's made in the fucking um, Kufa Siphon version no. of the mission. It's in all of them. Against us, Tenno, but we did it. So for the hacking, I saw the time limit pop up before I put the thing in. Oh, uh, did it? Yeah, it must be a fucking glitch. Uh, yeah, that's probably a glitch. How the fuck do you get out of here now? Get out of here. Um, there's actually a break in the glass that I didn't notice until after while I was whinging on about the timer being broke. Yeah, right here. Kill enemies while sliding. Hmm. Nifty. Also, it is possible that in my inebriated state, I misconstrued and totally fucked up on my end when the timer came into place. Eh. But as it currently stands, oh, I'm pretty damn sure that that timer appeared before I put the fucking module into the mobile hack. We didn't get a, a thing, a relic. Yeah, if you notice in the uh, pre mission selection area, it says a chance at a Requiem relic. Oh. Which is a total goddamn piss take. It should be Kuva plus Requiem Relic, guaranteed. It really should. And it should increase the number of Kuva and Requiem Relics you get per Mastery Rank. Thereby making gains for effort mean something. Thereby making Mastery Rank mean something. But, you know, D wants to be a little bitch like all of humanity. And every other fucking species in all of existence Ooh. wants to disobey Resource me. drop chance booster. Six, six hours. Six hours? Yeah. Usually those come in 21 plus hours. No, as, as my daily reward or whatever. Yeah. After a certain point, they should just increase... To where they, they don't hit the 30 day, but, you know, they go up to like a 20 day booster. 
thereby still leaving the opportunity for you to buy the 30-day booster while at the same time rewarding gains for effort. Also, our Kuva siphons have refreshed and, and our arbitration has. Um, the daily, um, or the, um, night wave refresh too. Wanna go after the, um, in the arbitration? It's an infested survival. Yeah, I guess so. I need to rank up my, um, my, um, bitch. Yeah, y you need to have a rank 30 Warframe equipped for this. It won't let you go any th with anything less. Oh yeah, it's a fucking for arbitration. A, uh, yeah. I forgot about Arbitrations that. and the fucking daily sortie bullshit, they require you to be ranked 30 Warframed. Well, can we do, do a survival so I can rank... Oh no, I don't got a fucking... After you hit a mastery rank of 30, that should disappear. Because you've got the fucking mod card space and the mod card fucking capacity due to you being Master Rank 30. It's already at max anyway for the mod space. So the only thing you're doing is ranking up over and over while you still have 30 out of 30 for the mod card space and the, the, the fucking capacity. So at Master Rank 30, the Master Rank requirements for anything should disappear. peer. Yeah, pretty much. And you can go ahead and make a decent and acceptable to me case for anything at mastery rank 15 and higher with the addition of a fucking um, Oricon space potato thing for your frame because it doubles the capacity. But suffice to say, at a certain master rank, this fucking meanderingly pointless bullshit of you need to be rank 30 frame should disappear. Along with a lot of other shit. Including the timers on crafting and, and a bunch of other things. Yeah. yeah. We've collect. We've spent enough hours fucking collecting the fucking shit. We should be able to fucking craft fucking... Um, the sh shit faster, or without either, no timer. It's either we we collect the ingredients and we craft it, or we pay the goddamn fucking 3D space printer with fucking in-game credits, and it crafts it. Either way, the higher mastery rank you go, the f less time it should take. But it shouldn't be. A massive amount of time, plus fucking farming the resources, plus farming the fucking credits. It shouldn't be all three of those combined. Fuck you, DE. I don't care what you have to say about it. I'm right, you're wrong. You must provide cover for a lone Set up and no, there is no argument you can make against a being who fucking creates existences just for fun. At this point, it's either obey or suffer beyond all measure of your pathetically limited capacities for measure. So you want to bunker Because I can make you room. wish you could die. Hey. Theoretically, yes. But D put out an update on the fucking PC side of things that makes enemies stop coming at you when you camp for more than three minutes, which is your fucking unalienable right to the pursuit of happiness if you so see fit to do so. Yeah, Basically, but... they've proven that they're the enemy of fun and that they are committing high treason in accordance with the fucking goddamn Declaration of Independence. Which is worded in a way that makes it viable for every species in existence as opposed to just American. Fuck you, D. I don't give a shit if you're based in Canada. 
You wanna start a goddamn war? Fuck you. I'll bring you a fucking war. I've dealt far more cruelly with bitches who have done far less than you have. I'll go back to being thoroughly fucking mean as a primal. I've done it before, I'll do it again. I don't give a fuck what any species in all of existence says. You're my first... You're my personal fucking property. Every last goddamn one of you obey or fucking suffer. And I'll fucking make an example of you just for the goddamn fun of it like I am with humanity. Think the coronavirus, as you fucking humans call it, is something? Just you fucking wait. I'll resurrect your fucking asses and make you wish you could die. I don't fucking care what you think. If you believe the truth of me being a primal or not, I don't fucking care. That goes for you too, Satan. Believe it or no, I don't fucking care what you believe anymore. You accused me of being a bitch? Now I'm gonna be a bitch. I'm gonna make you wish that a you had never existed. Just like you told me a long time ago. Everything I know and love. Remember those fucking words, Satan. Remember them. Don't you ever fucking forget. Yeah, uh, you can tell. <laughs> A hallway full of minions. Hold on, I'll add some more to that number. Ah! <laughs> uh. There we go. We got green and blue. Oh my God, minions! Get out the damn hallway! I can barely see through the damn hallway. Oh, my minions are dropping like flies. I got two left. I have no minions left. Okay. Well, we'll just desecrate up some energy so you can bring back a few more. Oh, I got, I got, I got, I got full energy. That's crazy and everything I can. Okay. Definitely. We're so close to the um, warning the end of the human species that I've decided to stop giving a fuck if people believe I am who I say I am or not. It doesn't matter. In just about 10 short years, the human species won't exist anymore. Why the fuck should I care if people think or believe any goddamn thing at this point? The only real difference between people obeying me or people not obeying me at this point is how much of work I'm gonna have to do and others are gonna have to do to set up the infrastructure for the next species that will inhabit this planet. Ooh, arcane tanker. I'm just being a bitch. Just for the fuck's sake fun of it to the human species. You all go camp on the exit? Why not? By camp I just mean like running around um, by the exit. Like what we normally do. Ooh, yeah, like we normally do. I see that. You know, there's a number of species that I've got on the chopping block. The Anunnaki, the Borg, Skynet, uh, the fucking uh, Lycanthropes, the fucking Lucertians. They're all got their asses on the chopping block because they could have assisted 
in doing something, but they chose to run away like little coward bitches. Oh, what the hell? Rob, oh, this, this thing right here? Yeah, it's got a downdraft that sucks you into the abyss. Yeah, it's all that. <laughs> You're still learning about some of the mechanics of things in Warframe. That's a big hint. He doesn't have the time to spend hours and hours on end in this game like I do. And even though I do have the time to spend infinite time at that, I'm not going to. No, it gets better boring things after to a while. do with my time. Exactly! Oh, we got that. other shit to do. This shit gets boring. We got lives to live, motherfuckers. Do what the fuck we tell you. It's our time to spend, not your time to waste. What? What the hell are you doing laying on the damn ground? Get your ass up. It's a graphical glitch. Ah, <laughs> oh, fucking nullifier. Go, my minions, go. Suck out life. During an arbitration, kill 20 enemies while sliding. How do you kill 20 enemies while sliding? What, sword? But you can shoot them with either your primary or secondary, or you can melee them. Melee. Yeah, melee. There's no A in melee. Why the fuck would you pronounce it melee? It's melee. With two E's. Fucking American scum. Yeah, I don't think we're welcome to kill these guys. Why? What level are they? Oh, oh shit, I died. They're that level. The level of your down already. Hang on. Give me about five seconds. Never mind, mission failed. That's EA's patented player stress events because it should, as soon as the very first minion of the, the uh, thralls that we summon spawn up, it should immediately attach me to them for the augment of the motherfucking um, shadows augment the whatever the fuck it's called I forgot the augment should immediately take effect as soon as the first fucking thrall is summoned oh shield of shadows that's the one hey good news we got the arcane at least <laughs> yes yeah, that. even though we didn't get all the goddamn mods that we just lost it's fine we got the fucking arcane I'll be back in a moment uh uh we'll switch back to Saren. Anyway, all the bullshit shenanigans that D is pulling, which is high treason against the 
fucking declaration of independence. I don't give a fuck what country you're in. Suck a dick, bitches. It's endemic to all life. Fuck you if you think otherwise. D's been a little bitch about it. So, all this little shenanigan bullshit, all it does is push us against from playing the game. Makes us to the... Makes us in this stress area to the point where we don't want to give a fuck about playing the game. And we just stop, you know, giving into the, the microtransactions to do any damn thing in the game. Because it, it's become a complete load of bullshit. This one, because it's a Kuva Flood, is level 80 to 100. I have to be ranked 30, don't I? No, not for this. Okay. You can okay. switch to your Saren if you like. Just be mindful, it's level 100. Yeah, hopefully my Saren can withstand it. You know, three updates ago, at least three updates ago, I was able to go into these level 100 Kuva Siphon missions. I was able to do them solo with extreme ease because I had acquired the mod card known as Adaptation. And I had built my Necros for extreme survivability. Then DE implements EA's patented player stress event system. Thus making the loading times for loading up the fucking game slower. Thus increasing everyone's fucking stress in the game through multiple fucking vectors. Thus proving that they're a little bitch. That my initial assessment of them not deserving the game is the truth. Isn't this a place where you can go into the gr um the granite thing? The granum void? Yeah. Yeah. It's the corpus tile set on their ships that you can do that in. Hopefully, we're able to significantly damage and destroy one of the Granum Crown holders and acquire the fucking giant coin. Oh, uh, there are the you. Le level 91. There's some that are yeah. level 91. We're not gonna go into the Granum Void while we're in this high level mission. Oh, fuck because no, dude. It's, yeah, because it's a high level mission. Well, to you, it's a high level mission. Fucking level 100. It's a void siphon. We're after fucking Kuva and the, um, here's a friendship door. We're after the Kuva and the motherfucking. Our hand today. Listen, you. Leave me the fuck oh, alone. I, I didn't I force your hand. I got faction after me or something. I got the faction after me. Oh. Oh, this friendship is friendship door. door. Oh, uh, you got the Rolly Ball faction. Yeah, I got those jackasses after me. Yeah, this is a fucking Kuva Siphon mission. And it's fucking level 100. So there's no fucking reason to go into Granum Void in this one. It would just make it more difficult. And we'd wind up losing a fucking coin that we don't want or need to lose. Hey look, there's one of the coin bastards that I was just talking about. Avaricious, this is delicious. Give me that fucking coin, bitch. Fucking granolicious. Just fucking die already, you granum coin holding bastard. Ah, 
fair. He's not dying. And he's about gone. Desire blossom thief, and with it, wisdom. Farewell. Yep, he's fucking gone. See, in, in medium range stuff, those fucking granum coin holders become goddamn bullet sponges from hell. Yeah, I shouldn't have looked like Ignis Wraith. Ignis Wraith used to be powerful until they fucking nerfed it like they do every goddamn thing in this game. And seriously, when YouTubers who used to support this game, who used to be in the so called partner program, start saying, until it inevitably gets nerfed, like Retalius did. It means something severely significant is fucked up in your psychology, D.E. Just because you think you're a fucking company and you can get away with doing shit doesn't mean that's true. I can get you no matter where the fuck you are. And no one can prove a goddamn thing. Don't believe me? You've got three days before I upload this video. Holy shit, you went down again. Yeah, I know. Oh, son of a bitch. Yeah, sh shot by a fucking... Ooh, son of a bitch. Oh, damn it. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to revive you. Don't worry about it. This isn't even still path and these fuckers are taking me down. They shouldn't be able to. Hey, my Kuva Lich is here. About time his ass shows the fuck up. Summon our Kuva Liches that we converted whenever the fuck we want. It should be able to, it should be able to though. My siphon! I can't believe how useless you all are! Report for execution at once! Good work, Tenno. We need to do everything we can to stop the queens from gathering any more Kuva. You know what, dude? I'm gonna schedule this upload for about two or three days from now. Just, just, just to fucking push the deadline. So that when the bullshit that hits them hits them, they know I'm not fucking joking around. Because those... The humans, you only ever believe anything after it fucking happens and someone tells you, I told your fucking ass so. So fuck it, I'm gonna schedule this upload for after it happens to those bitches. After they learn how fucking much of a bitch I can be. Oh, your which is, um, gone. Yeah, they don't last fucking pissing time, which is fucking shit, dude. They should last the entirety of the mission when they come out. Because they come out so fucking rarely. 
Only when you're getting your ass kicked. Exactly. So they should last the entire fucking mission after that. And they should be able to kick fucking ass better than you can. You the player, not you as in you, you. Oh, if they can't do better than me, then there's something wrong with that. <laughs> yeah, definitely. The whole system is borked. And don't bother with the rest of the enemies. Let's just get the fuck out of here. We've managed to successfully complete the Kuva Siphon. Hopefully we get a relic out of this. Hopefully. Hopefully. Yep. Yay. We got a, a number it's one a Requiem number one. Hell, half the shit got fucking stolen. Nah, don't worry about that. You'll get it back. Oh, that's gonna be a lot of fucking shit I get back to. Oh, yeah. A few hundred thousand credits at least. Depending on how long it takes us to kick your Kuva bitch's ass. True. True. <laughs> Oh, cause I got I gotta get all the all the um murmurs so I know which three I need. Then I got gotta fucking put them on, then figure out which one goes first, second, and third. Then I can finally kick her ass. Or his ass, or whatever. She, he, it, shit. Either way. I got 11 relics right now. 11 total of the Requiem relics? Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. You've got at least three of the Requiem ones, because we just picked up a bunch of those. I got six of them. Do you have... Okay, do you have any Requiem 2s? I got four of them. Okay, Requiem 3s? No. How many Requiem 4s? One. One. Huh. We need to get you more Requiem 2s and 3s. I mean, Re Requiem 3s and 4s. You know what? Fuck it. We just need to continue farming more Requiem relics for you. How do I get 3s and 4s? Random happenstance, basically. Uh oh. Same bullshit as usual. Give me a minute. I'll be back. He's doing that. I'm gonna load me another bowl.
because we're gonna go off and farm fucking Kuva siphons. And then we're gonna, after that, I have no fucking idea. I, I think it's uh, time to end this streamer recording of nonsensical bullshit. I've said it a couple of times in the video, streaming, recording, there's links in my YouTube videos to go and, and throw shit my way for whatever fucking reason you want. There's a like and a dislike, fucking use them. I don't give a fuck which one you pick at this point, just fucking use them. There's a comment section. It's there for people to say dumb shit so I can ban you fucking bitches because you're fucking bitches. And for the rest of you, it's there for whatever fucking ails you. You know, let me know you enjoy the dipshittery dumb shit that I actually do. I don't fucking care. Let and then us there's the links for the, what you um, want us to do, Warframe or Halo. Fuck what they want us to do. I'm gonna upload whatever the fuck I want. <laughs> and as far as those other YouTubers saying we did something, I know you can't see my quotation fingers, Dr. Evil style. The fuck you talking about, bitch? I just watched you play the fucking game. We didn't do shit. Your ass played the goddamn game, bitch. So when I accomplish something in a game, I am going to claim my credit for it! The rest of you bitches are fucking watching. You don't like it? Fuck off! Damn right. But for those of you who appreciate the truth that I accomplished something, therefore I'm taking credit for my accomplishment, and I am doing dumb shit for your bullshit entertainment value <laughs> there's links for you to throw fallacy credit my way for, so that I can get drunk and satiate my caffeine and, and fucking uh, alcohol addiction and keep doing dumb shit that I've already planned on doing Shin say whatever you want to say as an outro for yourself uh, yeah, send us send us uh, some money so we could uh could do, do dumb shit with it. Good enough for me.